question goes to the challenger, Mr. Bridges. Mr. Bridges, do you believe that big industry should be allowed to set their own pollution standards? No, I don't. That's something my opponent has always ignored. If I were elected, I would immediately push to toughen our state's environmental laws. Under Senator Quigley's leadership, our state has compiled one of the worst environmental records in the entire country. It's been a health hazard for all of our citizens, and I believe a change is needed. Thank you, Mr. Bridges. Thank you. Senator Quigley, same question. Good question, Judith. Say, my opponent is absolutely wrong. Say it, my opponent is absolutely wrong. My opponent is absolutely right. What are you doing? You disagreed with him. Say, I have all... For Carol Carr, this has been a long and heartbreaking journey. Do you understand your rights, Miss Carr? Do you understand your rights? This 63-year-old mother of three is accused of murdering two of her own children, 42-year-old Randy and 41-year-old Andy. I advise you the charges so you know what the charges are. Is that correct? She says she killed them out of love. In fact, Carol's family describes her as a devoted mom. Carol stayed home to raise her three sons, Randy, Andy, and youngest boy, Jimmy. Her husband, Hoyt Scott, worked at a factory in a small town outside Atlanta. They were a typical family. Then Hoyt's tremors started. Carol's dear friend and sister-in-law, Janelle Scott. We used to get together just about every Sunday. Their family was 